Dr. Mariam, the founder of BLA Fit. Welcome to my practice. I know you're here to learn how to use Bella Lip Appliance, but before we get there, let me give you a small introduction about myself. For 29 years in my practice, I've treated patients with craniofacial pain, TMJ problems, sleep apnea, and orthodontic needs, and I learned your facial muscle jaw function really well. That's why I invented a device that has resistant band in it that can be anchored around your lips for one minute a day and will work out your facial muscles all the way to your neck. It will plump your lips, define your jawline, and lift your cheekbones all naturally and non-invasively. That was only the cosmetic benefits. You can also, with adding the breath, tap into your parasympathetic nervous system and relax your body. Now there's do's and don'ts. I will invite you to my operatory so we can learn more. Let's go. Let me show you something very important. Before we do the exercise, I want you to remember to pay attention to what passes behind our lower jaw. We've got the major blood supply, nerve and artery that feeds our brain and facial structure pass in that region. So it's very important that all the exercises that are done with Bella Lip Appliance, there is a push forward while we're opening and closing. So that, that way we can open up the roadmap instead of impinging it. There are two exercises, the vertical exercise, the horizontal exercise. The vertical exercise is done to, in order to be able to plump your lips, define your jawline, and lift your cheekbones. It's one of the most important exercises of the Bella Lip Appliance. You can do it five slow repetition to start. In all the exercises, keep in mind, because your muscles are weak, you wanna hold the resistant arm so that the appliance doesn't torque or move away, so that you can stay centered. Notice I hold the tip of the resistant arm. I also did not anchor on my teeth. It was all on my lips. When I'm moving the arms, I'm using my upper lip and lower lip in order to do the job. And as I'm bringing them together, there is a push forward, jaw forward push. That's very important and crucial for your jaw and to get and tighten all your neck muscle. Let's look at it again. We're doing nice and slow, taking a breath in and breath out. Let's go back again. Let the opening to be non-forced. So when I'm letting the breath out and I'm letting my jaw relax and open up, I let it stretch out and without any type of a resistance. When I'm moving the arms together, it's all my workout, moving the jaw forward and then breath out and just releasing, letting your jaw relax. Now the length that I picked in this is the size of maximum opening that I want my patients to be able to open here when I'm treating their TMJ. What you feel is your lip and your facial muscle being worked out. There's blood circulation, all good stuff, but at the same time you feel this inner relaxation. You feel that your system, your nervous system is into a parasympathetic rest and digest area. And that's what you wanna do nice and slow, add the breath work to it, and you'll see the result. About five to seven of this to start with. The horizontal exercise is designed to be able to lift the corner of your lips and lift the cheekbones slightly. But when you wanna do it, again, you wanna hold the resistant arm tip. So the whole entire time, I'm gonna be ah, like an ah sound, when I'm doing it again, I'm gonna add the breath work to it. Notice I was in an ah mode when I was using the corner of my lips. We don't want the upper lip or the lower lip to do any job. This exercise is just the corner of the lip. Once again, the corner of the lips are holding the arms. There's no tooth or heart structure attaching the arms together. I promise you, you do this correctly, you not only are treating your TMJ and improving the blood circulation to your brain, tapping to your inner beauty, but you're going to have a workout of your life. Now that you are able to do the exercises, don't forget that in your introductory packages, 
we included a five minute one-to-one -one with myself or a team member who's certified in order for you to even better yourself on the exercises and ask any questions you have. My intention is for you to be an expert in Bella Lip Appliance and be certified one day how to do it and teach others. The idea is for you not to buy something on Amazon and just throw it out in the corner of your house or in the drawers. I want you to know how effective and how useful Bella Lip Appliance is. It is a durable device made in USA and it's for you.